the artists that have taken part in the program were given a chance to create a piece of work that's actually going to be featuring in the coronation, which we thought was an amazing opportunity for every artist involved. We just wanted to experiment with uh, representing each of us in the group as one whole, one community. So we took scans of each of our faces and collaged them together. The theme that we focused on for this particular project is service to the community. The artists have all created pieces around that theme in their different mediums, but then we also created an individual risograph piece, which is like a digital print that each artist has been able to create. It was the first time that I felt that I really had an opportunity to make an impact. It's completely changed my perspective on myself, given me more confidence and I believe in myself a lot more. I've made friends out of this as well and it's really pushed me forward into the art world and that means a lot to me because I felt like I was kind of on the outside for a long time. We were approached about a month ago by the Church of England to lead on a project that sought to kind of uncover hidden talent from across the UK. We've been able to create a huge legacy with this project as well, as the artists will be receiving a bursary that will go towards a project of their choice, and whilst also having their pieces exist in different locations across London. We've done four workshops where we were able to use London Metropolitan University and we collaborated with artist Joe Cruz, who led and facilitated a lot of the workshops, providing them with feedback throughout the experience, but also masterclass sessions, where they were able to learn about different mediums, such as risographing, which was new to me as well. And it's been incredible to see how they've been able to translate their own work into this new medium that none of them really knew about before. I took from like the idea of like two people to show that we all have like a bit of each other within each other and how like I give what I have for you and you give what you have for me. Like how we serve each other, how we influence each other's life and how like our interactions with others feed into who we are. When I think of community and the community that has supported me and the community that I work with um, from my youth work, I think immediately of sisterhood and having a safe space to lean on one another and having a support system. For my Riso piece, it's a recreation of my sculpture and it involves two members of the Creative Commission community. I was really inspired by the chair collection that we saw at London Metropolitan University. One chair in particular stood out to me, um, the Prince of Wales chair. Chairs serve people. We sit on a chair and it holds us and that's just a good analogy I think for service, um, that we want to raise people up and hold them in our service. The wash basin represents foot washing, which is a very humbling act and taken from the Bible uh, where Jesus washes the disciples' feet um, and encourages Christians to do the same, not literally, but in their lives, just serving others. As an ex-librarian myself, I have experienced just how much librarians and the library means to a community. Um, so I wanted to focus on what they bring um, to everyone. What the red side means is, it's me before I had a community. So I was quite resentful, I was quite bitter. But then since having a community, it's shown me the beauty in life and it's made my life a lot lighter. I hope people take away from this project inspiration inspiration that they could even do something that could benefit their own community. The three things that I've seen the artists learn most, I would say, is one, the importance of collaboration, two, the importance of listening to feedback, and three, kind of trial and error. I think it will be interesting to see how far along society has come from, you know, the coronation of um, Queen Elizabeth. And I think these pieces will be you know, a great feature in that, in terms of the progression of society and, and even in the artwork that's been put together. I think that there's some really reflective themes um, in terms of the world we live in today. That existence in, in this moment will be beautiful.